Hi everyone, welcome back to Google OAuth Shenanigans with Linda. And as always, I would be Linda. Today we're going to talk about one of the most annoying Google OAuth errors that I have seen people complain about. The message, invalid grant, your token has expired. This error can stump even experienced developers. So I'm going to give you a quick and easy fix for it in this video. And I'm going to try and clear up some misconceptions about this error and explain the common cause. This error is typically caused when your refresh token has expired. The confusion starts with the fact that refresh tokens aren't supposed to expire. This is the whole point of a refresh token, right? Well, that's true, except for test applications. A number of years ago, Google made a change which causes all refresh tokens for test applications to expire after seven days. Actually, they don't expire. The user's grant or consent that they granted to your application is basically revoked and removed, which causes all refresh tokens to, of course, also be revoked. If you think about it, it does make sense. If your app is in testing, you shouldn't really need a long-lived refresh token. This was added, in my opinion, to improve the security for our test users. This may also have been an attempt to encourage you to verify your app, making you think that the only way to get a long-lived refresh token was to verify your app. This may surprise you, but you don't need to verify your app to get a long-lived refresh token. All you need to do is set your app in production. By simply clicking this button on the consent screen, your app will be in production and any refresh tokens created by your app after that will be long lived and no longer expire after seven days. Easy, right? Just click the button and run your app again without the existing refresh token. You need to remember to remove that. Then when you run your app again, it should pop up and request consent of the user again and return a new refresh token. This refresh token will then be long lived and not expire. To summarize, the invalid grant error, token expired or revoked, can occur when your refresh token has expired. If you are experiencing this error, you can fix it by setting your app into production. It will cause all refresh tokens created by your app to then be long lived and no longer expire in seven days. If you're still having trouble, please leave a comment and let me know and I'll try and help. Thanks for watching, and if you found this video helpful, please remember to like and subscribe. I have more videos like this in the works, so be sure to stay tuned. Bye.